Amen. Sing it one more time. Amen. Amen. Have a tic tac. Amen. 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 One more time. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Today's Sunday service review. Uh, did you want to tell something you learned today in church? I didn't really know what was going on. He was pretty busy coughing and sneezing. And yeah, the mask we gave him, I think it had something in it that kind of made him have some allergic reactions. All right, go with Dad and get changed out of your, into your bed clothes. All right, Brother Philip, what did you learn today in church? Amen. Okay, that's enough. We're being funny. Amen. Guys. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay so what did you learn today in church? Well, today in church, we talked a lot about a parable that I actually find pretty interesting. Oh, do you? That actually applies to a lot of uh, teenagers in this day and age. Well, let's hear it. It was the story of the son who wanted who wanted his inheritance from his father to go out and do whatever he wanted in the world because he was tired of living under the roo- of his parents' roof and having rules. And, not, and he thought there was so much more in the world that he could do. And, yeah, I really like that story because then the teenager, that dude, he, I don't know if he's, is he grown up yet? Is he 18 yet? Yeah, is, yeah, the guy who left. Yeah, the, the kid who left. Yeah, he left. Was he an adult? He now? was an adult. He was an adult? Yeah, he was a full adult, yes. Oh, okay. Well, yeah. You can't do a lot of riotous living if you're not grown. That's true. You can do mm-hmm. some, but not legally. Wasn't the legal age like a little bit younger back then? Though? I'm sure it was, but I'm pretty sure he was an old. Whatever age it was that they considered people to be adults back then, I'm sure he was considered an adult. Yeah, but it was, it was probably younger than 18 because he was very immature. But he wanted his um, inheritance from his father, and his father gave it to him. And he went off, traveled around, partied all the time, and eventually spent all his money because mm-hmm. he didn't work or anything. To get just more had a good money. time. So yeah, he just had a good time, blew straight through all the money, and then ended up in the pig slop, um, taking care of pigs. Mm-hmm. That was yeah. no fun. That was no fun, and eventually he realized all the things that his father had given to him, and had he had been blessed with. He had been blessed with a roof over his head. He didn't have to work, he, or he didn't have to pay for bills or anything like that. He had. All that he could ever, he could ever, yeah, he could get all that he needed to sustain himself with. Yeah, he had it all. And he mm-hmm. decided he just left it all behind because he was tired of having his father or having rules and not mm, seeing yep, the rest yep, of the yep, world. Yep, yep. And eventually, he went back to his father, expecting to be treated like a stranger and wanted to just, or expected to just have to work like a servant. To make mm-hmm. his money, because the servants were living, the servants in his father's house, house were living better than he was. Mm-hmm. And, mm-hmm. Because they, even they had extra money to spare. Yeah, they had enough and enough extra. Yeah. And that's something. That's so, a good boss for you right there. Yeah. And so, he decided to go back there expecting to be treated differently, but he was treated like he was, they were, his father rejoiced and threw a party for him when he returned, because... Mm-hmm. He was lost, and then he was he had found his way, mm-hmm, and that's mm-hmm. kind of like it relates to how all the angels in heaven rejoice whenever somebody is saved. Yes, like um, 
Yeah, like all like in the Bible it says, even if, if it's just one person who saved, all the angels in heaven rejoice. So it's just it's just pretty cool. So it lets yeah. you know that you can come back to the Lord. Yeah. And he will receive you. Mm-hmm. All right, all right. Well, that's a blessing. That's a real blessing. I think we'll just end the review right there. Because there are plenty of other things we could have talked about, but I think that takes the cake. Yeah, buddy. All right. Well, I'm Minister Conway, and this is Brother Philip. We hope you enjoyed this Sunday service review. Y'all take care and be blessed. Mm-hmm.